Welcome back. The last time we rescued, or recruited, Marin Comwind, and now we need to find Goldrick Donnies. So we've done Hewell Hall, we've explored all of Glum Island, but there was somewhere on the western bank we haven't gone yet. I believe this is the last part of Glum Cove to explore. There we go. Gorik Donmace is trapped on the other side of the Whittled River. This way. Okay. So yeah, I don't think there was anywhere else that I could go. Yeah, it's all blocked off by the briars. Yeah, so I think this is it. This is it for Glunko. Whittled River Valley. Following Whittled River and ending in the pinch, Thurgeon's Way was the main trade route across Razorus. Unfortunately, outside of the Smuggler's Maze, it was just about the only way to cross Razorus, and this made it a prime source of income for the droves of cutthroat bandits that roamed the woods of Razorus. Recognizing this, the Razoran court deployed a band of soldiers to guard the banks of the river. Their wily and fearless leader was Gulric Donmace. Alrighty, we see a scroll and a secret. This is our first time with the ice tile set, maybe. I'm glad you've come to help, Gunthro. Okay, so I've come to help, but what's the problem? Who's that? Goldrick Dawn Mace. Looks kind of like us, but with a helmet. And a clone. Okay, and then there's a, a secret there. Okay, and here are blue doors, so I'm guessing we use the... Oh, they have rafts as well, interesting. So, despite rafts being Skondusk March's main thing, uh, we have we have them appearing in this level as well. And of course, a single road should deal with. Golurik Donmace! Gunthrow! Unfortunately, the bridge is out, even with my squad mates to aid me. I cannot cross. You'll have to take over as squad leader while I'm trapped here. I can help. I'll drop the blue gates, and then we can repair the bridge. Good luck. Press tab or click on a squad mate to command them. Okay, so hit tab. See it lights up. And now, if I do my turn, see this is a clone, and this is the player here. Roach is only going towards the active player. Player. Oh. Right, that can get annoying. Every turn he's going to keep hitting that because I left him there. So basically we get to choose between which, uh, which person we want to have active at any given time, and that the active person is the only one the monsters will be trying to kill. There's not a whole lot I can do here. This. So if I do this, I can get them around. But from here, there's no way for this clone to get them up or down. So let's just get them both there. Like that. Okay. And yeah, I'm using tab, so I'm more comfortable with it, but you can click. It also avoids the sound. If you have multiple clones, that might be a good way to do it. Okay, so here... You no, know, trapdoors, also. Yeah, so this is a little bit more complicated already. Although the clones do make things a lot easier. Right, so it's not a lot I can do there. And now... I see they won't... They won't attack you. Well, that's while you're while you're controlling the other clone. So easy enough to get around them. Clones are kind of a weird element. Uh, they make things a lot easier most of the time. Not a huge fan uh, compared to a lot of other elements. They can be used cleverly, but. Like this room, for example, it's just going to be four different puzzles using four different clones, which is fine. Okay. 
Ooh. Ah, different sets of arrows, okay. Trapdoor puzzles. Okay, and here we have a bridge puzzle. So the problem here is whoever goes across those is going to be stuck. So I need to get the squatty to help me out. Just have to maneuver the raft. I do find it kind of weird that they've used so many elements from the other levels in this one. Uh, it makes for more interesting puzzles, but I'm just surprised that they've already chosen to do this. Yes, you can. You can stab yourself. Don't do that. Uh, let's not be stupid about this. Yeah, also, just yeah, you have to not do that. So this is gun throw here. So prepare. And off we go. It doesn't take a turn to switch between, so you can do you however you want. Now it's just a matter of getting the roach to us. Like that. No problem. This is a little bit more complicated. So we have here. Rafts from here. Ah, I see. We now go across here. And like this. And that lets us release. Trap door. So let's just go in here. And then we can get out with the squatty. Wait a moment, Unc. The way you tell it, it sounds like Gunther walked in, but a squatty walked out. Shut up, Hell. Maybe I got it a bit confused in the retelling. That's not important. So, I'm kind of curious whether the joke came first or the room came first, but either way, that was well played by Carl on that. I approve. And last room already. Oh, this was fast. Oh, let's not just run in for the checkpoint. So the problem here is that we cannot let the roach Step on the force arrows, okay.
So I saw that, and I was just looking for a way through here. I can get through there, but not if the trapdoor is down. So... I have a secret up here. And what's going on here? A oh, pressure plate, even. Okay. So you can't get across these force arrows. This roach has to go here. Not too bad. So basically what I'm going to do here is build a bridge that and that will let me do that. And that gets the roach to the pressure plate. Let's see how the roach out. And I am free to go. Trapdoors reset. And we already got our exit level. So back we go. Have I missed anything else? Any other secrets? Great job! Now let's fix up this bridge. I don't think I have. So how does this work? Right, Thanks. Now, how can I help? Join the leaders at the entrance to Smuggler's Maze. The Twainans have killed the king, and we are going to war. Can this be true? But why would they break the truce? That, I do not know. But come, there is work to be done. Despite his name, Goldrick Dunmace does use a sword. Reward 600 Greckles to whomever brings me Goldrick Dunmace, dead or alive. His meddling has gone on long enough. The Bandit King. Okay. That was well worth reading, I'm sure. Right, uh, so as we saw earlier, it doesn't actually matter who leaves, so we'll just do that. And it is still us. Well done for rescuing Gulrick. Alright, so Gulrick, that is six. Is that everybody? Smuggler's Maze. Alright. Six people. Greybeard, Artist Frostbart, or Blade Seeker. General Drakendut, Baron Conlin, and Goldrick Don Mace. Everyone is here. Onward to Smuggler's Maze. Alright, and that is where we will continue next time. So, onward to Smuggler's Maze. <laughs>